This video is sponsored by the Outcast Seal. Feeling like a seed in the ground, nigga. All I want to do is grow. Uh, but that shit going too slow. Niggas be doing the most. Can wait till I make it and glow. Now let me just switch up the flow. Switch up the pace. For those who recognize anime subtleties, you'll find a new appreciation for this piece. On top of that, each person will have a one of one staple piece added to their fit. Outcast Seal, out now. No reason to wait. Go get yours now. That's why it's going to be interesting because. Do the, do, the, do the style match what, how they look? I think I could be good at this. I'm just competitive. All right, I'm, I'm just gonna, gonna, I'm gonna say this, but you could have great style but still be busted. No, but you can still see their legs and you can see their. That don't got nothing to do with their face. It has a lot to do with it. Probably too many to count. <laughs> too many to <laughs> count. Yeah, but I might not go see. I don't know how the hell you're supposed to pick who you want to be with based on waist down. How I I don't I feel like that's why I think that's why it's gonna be interesting because do the do the, do the style match what, how they look. I think I can be good at this. I'm just competitive. All right, right? I'm just gonna, gonna to I'm gonna say this, but you could have great style but still be busted. No, but you can still see their legs and you can see their. They don't got nothing to do with their face. It has a lot to do with it. I don't think there's a lot of people that like have nice bodies but ugly faces. What can you really tell about their bodies? No, but right not now? about their bodies. Think about how many people do you know that have nice bodies but just ugly faces? It's really rare. I don't think it's as rare as you think it is. It's more rare. I've seen times where I was like, "Oh, nice," I was like, "Damn." <laughs> but it's not. But it's very rare. Like, I, 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 usually, it's, it's usually just average face. Like most people, I don't know. Maybe, maybe most people are probably you, I pretty think average. You, I think you. Uh, I know there's not many other people on here. You might not ghost me. So my name is Garrett Brown. I graduated college a couple years ago and I'm currently working on an app to help out some charities. I do value women who can dress, you know, not up to standards, but as long as they're comfortable with what they're wearing and they feel good what they're wearing, that's all I look for. Wait, hold on. See how he's my style hold on, right now. He said he's... not up to standards. What does that mean, bro? Maybe it means like high, high end. He doesn't necessarily mean like high end dressing necessarily. Oh, I thought maybe he meant maybe his standards or some society standards that he's actually not saying. But then he just undid everything he said by saying, like, as long as they're comfortable. So it's, he's yeah, like, I value they're... women that as long as they're comfortable. You know what I mean? Yeah, because like, if it... they're comfortable, then they're going to wear what they wear and not have, not wear to some standard. Yeah, which is why I think he, uh, it's that same thing where people are always like, people are always like trying to say the right answer. Now is a D minus TikTok star. Do you only give yourself a D minus? I'll do C minus. I'll do C, I'll do C plus. How about that? We'll do that. If you're C plus, is that a star? Okay. Yeah, what? All right. So if you're C plus, is that a star? He said he's a, a D minus or C plus TikTok star. I mean, I, I guess he's trying to go off the fact of like celebrity A lists, celebrity B list, celebrity. You know what I mean? And D list is like just a regular person. <laughs> my, on my scale, he's. We have a wide variety of some personalities here. I'm liking what I see a lot. You guys are setting me up very well right now on some blind dates. So number one, well, what's your name? Like My name is Liz. Liz, nice to meet, nice to meet you. I'm Garrett. Another thing is you can hear off their voice because your voice actually has to do with the shape of your of your neck and everything. So you can hear pretty, at least to the neck. You can sound pretty, but be busted. But you have to like fake it more. I'm saying like the shape and of your- And they can fake it easily behind the curtain. I know, but it would sound. You think these people like took classes to like to make special voices before? I'm guessing. How I, easy is it to really change your voice? I just changed my voice right now. But that's no, that's still your voice. You're just changing tone. You're not like. Yeah, and then I, you're not making tone. a different. You're not making a different voice. You have a pretty tone. I think that's no. People have pretty voices. Talking? Voice and tone, okay. different things. Okay. Voice is like the whole thing. Okay. Tone is just okay. like the pitch. Okay. High pitch, low pitch. Okay. Are we wearing this as an everyday shoe or is this a dress up shoe? Yeah, this is an everyday shoe. It's I'd probably wear this to work or on a night out with the girls. What does a night out with the girls look like? How crazy are we getting? 10 tequila shots. 10 tequila shots. All right, yeah. so See, I'm getting blacked out. That's another thing. She said 10 tequila shots, she can eat that. She <laughs> and she said that's normal. So I think I'm right on that one. Okay. Okay, well. What's your name? Chloe. All right, so those dunks right there. The way she answered, I think she's obsidians. 
I think those are called Mercedes. Those, the left of me, those are dunks. These are Air Force, our um, ones. All right, so do you consider yourself to be a fashionable person? I'm more of like a comfortable street style type of person. Okay, so you're active on Depop. No. No? <laughs> no. I'm Jackie. So what do you consider your, your style to be like? I'm more into like the Japanese lifestyle called Wabi Sabi, and it's like embracing the imperfect. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm excited to learn a little bit more about that. Number four, you're hiding your shoes. Is that for a good reason or a bad reason? You know what? You know what? Let's not judge straight <laughs> off. This isn't the main part of the outfit, you know? Where are you from and where do you get your fashion taste um, from? So I'm from Toronto, which Ooh. may explain why I may not have brought the best shoes. <laughs> I'm very into fashion, just not shoes. So. Okay. Are you a big Drake girl from Toronto? Oh, no, 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 honey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no Drake girl. I don't know about that. I think the, I don't think Toronto really like, I feel like it's like Toronto doesn't really. Be, I don't, I can't even I give know. any context. But I've heard other things where like, I don't know, it's, it's we I always identify with the Toronto. I don't know necessarily if Toronto is all the certain parts of Toronto. I can't see, them. I can't, my thing is I can't see Toronto necessarily disowning him or like having somebody. Him. That's not what I'm saying. I just don't think that, I think when people go other places, I think we have more than just Drake. That's kind of the vibe. You know what I mean? Oh, boy. When they, because people yeah. always just like, the only thing we know about Toronto is Drake. And so everywhere you go, it's just, oh, Drake, Drake. It's I mean, like... but I think that if you're involved in, have some type of connection to Toronto or that community, whatever, then you have other knowledge of that than Drake. But like, I only know, like, I don't but I'm saying I... that's why they're responding that way because they have other knowledge. So like, when someone brings oh, up Drake, they're like, fair, 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 fair. fair. Someone's like, oh, have okay. you been to the, have you been to the to, uh, Liberty Island? Have you seen Statue of Liberty? And people are like, no, no, no. If you're from New York. Yeah, yeah, because that's, that's, yeah. yeah. Fair point. I'm a big Aubrey fan, that's for sure. Last, we have a nice pair of shoes hiding down there. I'm Those Kaylee. Like Do you like to wear custom, colorful like shoes? That. These are actually a gift. I would not have, like, picked them myself, but I, like, I like them a lot. So you dress more neutral when it comes to color in general, or? I like neutral shoes because I feel like colorful shoes don't go with every outfit, so. All right. Well, I'm liking what I'm seeing a lot. Bro, you gotta eliminate based off of the shoes? He's gonna eliminate the girl to the left. He probably should know, because she probably is the most freaky. Time Man. about what? <laughs> Time about what? <laughs> her, she said, I'll take care of you. And he's gonna eliminate her because she doesn't have the best, like, shoes I actually style. didn't think that's who he was gonna eliminate. Oh, I think so, because she's the only one that stands out. So what, all right, so you're going that one. Yeah. I'm going... Oh, the dirty shoe girl. Yes. <laughs> you might be right. I forgot about the dirty shoe girl. <laughs> and... So number one scares me. You know, the 10 tequila shots. She seems like a very wild card. But number one does have the difference, you know? A lot of the shoes are similar. Toronto is hiding her shoes. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to have to let go of Toronto. Oh, shit. All right, that makes sense. That actually is the five. What? Oh, no. <laughs> what? Run the five. I didn't get, I didn't put any money out there. <laughs> I would have thought deeper if I had. <laughs> You're kidding, Garrett. I'm making nice to meet you. Made you. A mistake. Oh, I'm very sorry. You're... He made a mistake. I don't know. He's gonna, yeah. but maybe not because he's. We don't he might not even him. like him because she's taller in in flat sneakers. Uh, whatever. If she can't get over the. The height. No, but I'm saying he might be thinking that he's like, oh, oh. fine, I'm not a loss to me because she oh. might not have even liked me anyways. Oh. That's what I'm saying. Okay, okay. Outfit is awesome. Thank you. What are you, like 6'5"? Six, 6'1". <laughs> <Come on, laughs> <now. one. laughs> you're not 6'1", you're absolutely I'm not 6'1". Six six one. One. I'm so, You're just Yo, short. Why is <laughs> oh. Okay, see what happens when you, see what happens? They turn on you just like that, right? <laughs> I'll tell you everything I you want to hear and I'll turn on you. Why are you intimidated, my man? Intimidated, bro. She's just taller. What, it's not. He's taller. Oh, six five, and then she clapped back. And then... Yeah, like why you gotta do that? Because we all know what it is that she's probably not gonna date anyone that's shorter than her. And so you it's the that. elephant in the room. We don't know that. She clapped back. She was like, "You're just because short. he can't." But he came at her first. And he said, "What are you six five? That yeah, but maybe she because uh, I feel like I feel like being a tall girl, you get kind of looked at differently. Not if you're attractive. You think look at what he just did. Look at what he just did. No, she was just sensitive about it. He said, oh, you, he was like, oh, you're tall. I don't think that that's a bad thing. Maybe, well, it depends. I'm Yo, not, leave, it, leave it in the comments. Let's, let's, let's yeah. hear you out. Is it leave worse it in the to be a tall girl or a short guy? Mmm, I like that. Let us know. I like that. I like that. I like that. <laughs> See you soon.
See you soon, hopefully. Oh my gosh. My heart's breaking right now. But also, we don't know who else is behind there. You can't get too committed to one. I'm not gonna front. I'm liking what I'm seeing. They all look what? I feel like they're all short. Maybe not the ribbed jeans. Yeah, they are. about their legs. Yeah, not by the not ribbed jeans, but like everyone else, I think they're all short. No, I think she's short because her, see her thigh right here. Her thigh is really starting. So I think that she's probably short as well because her waist is basically right here. Okay. So she's at least I, I think to this girl. I think maybe she's she's the tallest out of the rest. Okay. Yeah. A lot of streetwear oriented. Okay, so number one. I mean, don't you get hot wearing that? I mean, we're in California. I don't know how you can. That's how you, you know, keep your body looking good. You just sweat throughout the day. Oh, she's black. So when you say you'll take care of me, what does that, oh, what does that right. mean? You know, I'll turn you on your you side so you won't throw up after the night <laughs> of drinking. You know, give soup. Sometimes we can tell from you. Some <laughs> soup and you'll turn me on my side so I can throw up on the floor instead of the bed. <laughs> well, I'll put the trash can there so I don't have to clean it up. You can take it out. Oh, so I'll take it out in the morning. Okay, that's perfect. Yeah, in the morning, okay, yeah. <laughs> Moving on to number mm. two. Be honest with me when I ask you this question. Okay. How many men have you ghosted in your lifetime? <laughs> Probably too many to count. <laughs> too many to count. Uh, yeah, but I might not ghost you. Might not ghost me. You seem like a nice man so far. All right, well, I'll take that. <laughs> what do yo, you think, what do yo, you think yo, yo, yeah, yeah, hold on. <laughs> he saw the fit and he was like, I've seen too many of these. <laughs> That is a ghost of shit right there. <laughs> that is, with the Yo. legs open, the tan, tan legs open in the air. Yeah, what's a ghost of shit? I like the whole charity thing. Oh, you're hyping me up too much now, all right? <laughs> what does your relationship with your dad look like? My dad? Yeah. I'm a big daddy's girl. He's like my best friend. Big daddy's girl? Yeah. Number three. Oh, well, he's those basically pants. like trying to, he's really trying to say something right he's now. Really trying to say he's something really trying to say something, say something and we're not going to say it. But I'm saying that he's trying to say it. Yo, know, if you know, saying. drop it in the comments. That's that's all. I'm, I don't know what it is. So yeah, you're, I don't know what it is either. I don't know what it is either. But he's trying to say something. He's trying to say something. <laughs> I wonder what it was that made that made him go in. He must have like an ex or something. Some that has clothes like this. He's had experience something now, that or, yeah, is bringing back memories. Good. I like them. They Thank sit you. well. What what kind of pants are those? They're she's corduroy. It, it's actually on. overalls. Oh, okay, so it's a one piece up and top. Asian, so. Why do you think you're single right now? Just truly just have not met the one. The one? Okay, so you're looking for the one, the one right now. I mean, as you get older, you have no choice. <laughs> Number four. So tell me a little about yourself. What do you want people to think when they see your outfit? I always say like I dress like elevated casual. Like I want to look put together, but I want to look comfortable and like I could fit in in like any scene. And then where'd you say you were from? I'm from Kansas City. Now do people in Kansas City normally dress like this? Like when I go home now, I definitely get some like looks my way, kind of mm -hmm. some disapproving ones sometimes. <laughs> I think he's gonna like that because she doesn't. She fights she, against the. She fights the against norm. the grain, yeah. and like she's she she stands out, but she can handle it. I'm gonna say this: the second he saw him, found out she was black, I think it stopped, took him out of the running, and he doesn't like this. He said he liked Aubrey, so you know he might have a Next jungle. Arby's? Beat. Aubrey. Aubrey's not. Aubrey Grant. Drake? Drake's not. Drake's not the parameter for black. I know Definitely that black woman. I know that. <laughs> I know that. But he's in. Hip hop, he's like hip hop, hip -hop culture, culture is pop culture right now. But that's he, not the, that's... That, fair. But what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, he might have the jungle fever. He might have the jungle fever. That's what why I'm is saying. it called jungle fever? Like I don't know jungle. why. Because they're called oh, monkeys. monkeys. Yeah. But either way, I'm just saying he might have it. <laughs> okay. He might have it. Okay. The drinking, the she knows I'm going to be throwing up, so we're drinking a lot. <laughs> We don't have oh, hey. Hello, I'm Liz. Nice to meet you. Garrett, nice to meet you. I'm sorry we can't go out clubbing. I... The second I saw the, the lashes, I knew that it was not for him. Yeah, but, I don't think I, but I think she, he, I think he she wrapped it up nice though. and he said, You're beautiful and I'm, I took an L and all this type of stuff. Well spoken. But, yeah, well spoken. One now. What are your red flags and men so I can make sure that I do not fall into those. You have to be funny. I'm really sarcastic and I feel like people take it as mean sometimes so you have to get my humor. Will you make me cry on a date? Probably. I love toxic women. That's that's my thing right there. <laughs> so number two, the overalls. I love them. Yeah, thank you. I think it looks great. I love the brown. If you could pick 
one thing about your dream guy that matters the most to you, what would it be and why? Literally just like being open-minded and open to trying new things. Last one, I'm loving the blazer. Thank you. It screams, yeah, I'm here to make some money. I'm here to do my thing. Get out of my way or I'll spit on you. And I love that. It's <laughs> really trying Yeah, to sure. So what is our so first far, date looking skin. like? We could pick up some Thai takeout and then go somewhere really pretty Yo, why you and have like a go sunset. Why you raise tank, bro? Look, that's all we can see. <laughs> that's all we can see. It's clothing and skin color. Those are the two things we have. That's what I was we going for. Picnic by the ocean. We could play a game, like a card game or something. Just like a really chill, but like plenty of quality time. I'm absolutely with that. So do you consider yourself a big nature and like beach kind of girl? I would consider myself more mountains. The left? Yeah. All the way to the left? Yeah, the, the drip dreams. Who he's been, he's been like riffing with the entire time. Yeah. I think she's gone. Well, actually, I'm gonna go with overalls. Because you think she just didn't make an impression? Yeah. Okay. I think, okay. It's just so hard because I like all of them. They all have great outfits and I've been 0 for 2 so far. So that just makes <laughs> me feel even better knowing that I'm gonna mess it up again. So unfortunately, number two, the middle one, will be the first oh, right. one that I'll be letting go today. Dude, that's 10. He actually, yeah, <laughs> that's you, 10. You, you're hitting me. <laughs> like the girl that, he, he likes toxic women. He literally actually likes that. He said, I like toxic women. Oh, I can't lie. There's a taste to him. <laughs> Yeah, that's all I'll say. <laughs> I can't look again. I can't do it again. I can't do it. Oh, hey, yep, another L. Are you kidding me? Garrett. Jackie. Nice to meet you. I'm so sorry for letting you go. You look absolutely great. Hopefully in the future, you can put me on to some more of that food yeah, and some music. Sure. All right, thank you. Ooh, yeah. The last person I will be letting go is... Drum roll, please. Do you have any drums in here? I think it's left. I think it's left. <laughs> Unfortunately, number one, I will be letting number one walk today. Let's see what she is. Come on, oh my, are you kidding me? I'm so sorry. It's okay. I love it's the nice bucket hat. You. you were hiding that under there. Come on now. It was nice meeting you. Yeah. Good luck in the future. Thanks. And stop being so toxic, Jeez. right? I'll try. What? He's trying to cut her number. She was low-key tight, like. Yeah, he's trying she to get was her like just there. trying to get out. She thought her she was making jokes and stuff, and he. It was close. It was definitely close. Yeah, but I think he's had his mindset out of her from the beginning, like what you were saying about. Oh, with the shoes. Yeah, they, they can't even see what I'm talking about. But she looks good with the white, dark, and black contrast. Yeah, there. it definitely fits. Um, but she is the one that he had his mind set on from the beginning. I think, like you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sweating doing this, man. This is heartbreaking. I don't want to do this. <laughs> Alright, let's see it. Let's what if she's it. a dub? <laughs> what if he sees it and he has Listen, to really think? That it? will prove what I said earlier, where he has <laughs> a nice voice and it's a busted face. No, nah, I think she's I, she's got look. Well, she says Kansas. Let's so see. You, I think I think she'll probably look good. Hey, <laughs> Garrett. Kaylee. Nice. Honestly, if we gonna, if I'm keeping but it a buck, probably the I'm, least if I'm keeping facially it buck, attractive person of people there. Le yeah, least facial, facially attractive. But when I, if I'm keeping it a buck, first shorty that left, most the, attractive. First girl that left? The first girl that left was most attractive out of the whole line. We'll have to see it. I don't That's know. Well. That was I love the, the, the dirty shoe girl. That was from Toronto. It's either, the tall her, girl. It's either her or Jean's girl. Yeah. Yeah. It's great. You. I Thank love you. the change. You're like how I like to describe myself, like elevated casual. Like you got the YSL and you got some clean shoes, but you're still like super comfy looking. I think like, they fit each other. I know you're comfortable in what you're wearing, you know? Absolutely. All right, perfect. See, that's the vibe I was trying to give off. She face. read it perfectly. <laughs> We're thinking like each other already. So, oh, there'll be some. <laughs> what? I don't want a bunch yeah. of random dudes to have my number. Bunch of random no, dudes? How many it. dates are you going? Wait, she denied him too. She did? Oh, there'll be some IG swap today, yeah. that's for sure. Yeah, I don't give my number until the second date. It goes, <laughs> what? I don't want a bunch yeah. of random dudes to have my number. Oh, okay. Bunch of random no, dudes? How many dates are you going on? Not that man? many, but you know what I mean? <laughs> If I go on like one date, I don't want this dude on my number forever. Okay, I mean, I don't know. I think I caught her slipping. I guess we'll see. I like her a lot. She's got a nice sense of style. She's cute. She means business. A lot of people want her number. I got a lot of competition. I don't know. We'll see what happens in the future. She is tall, but like, I think that she's the best looking one out of the whole group. Yeah, I guess she would definitely be like the most average of the people there. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Interesting. I was wrong. I got her. I don't know. I was wrong. That's 15, bro. 
I thought, yeah, I didn't think that, I don't know, what was it for him? Was it the skin? Like, she had the lightest skin, and so that's what he was going after? Bro, it died. <laughs> Keep going to this race thing, bro. <laughs> well, okay, so what do you think it was? Because first, the shoes. Because he was attracted to, I think, the idea that she's able to stand out and be okay with that. Then why didn't he go with the first girl? Because she had, she she was the one that only had. He was nice... turned off from her because of the Alcohol? drinking. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I guess that's what he said. I'm good with it. <laughs>